Here we have a Shimano Alphine 8 speed hub gear with none of the necessary parts mounted to it. We've had so many people calling about fitting these bits that I thought I'd do a video because it's much easier to explain it by seeing it than uh, over the phone. Um, the first bit to go on, once you've applied a little coating of grease, is the dust cap. That just slips on, doesn't matter where it is, it just slips on. Next is your chosen sprocket, this is a 22 but put on whatever you want. That slips down onto the three little tabs. Then it's the next bit, which is uh, the bit that everyone dreads, is the snap ring of doom. They're actually not that difficult to fit, provided you've got the right tools. A couple of small flat bladed screwdrivers and a little coating of grease on everything tends to help. What I do is, rather than putting it down, the obvious thing of putting it onto that first step, come down at a slight angle and hook one end in. Sometimes holding it in with that with the first screwdriver can help. I often don't need to and I'll just do it with a finger just to see if I can manage it. Then I come in like you would with a tire lever and lever it over. See even I struggle and I've done lots of these. And you just have to work your way around slowly prising it over the top see now it's actually sitting a bit better I can let go of that first end and then just work it all the way around and there we go snapped on just give it a light push just to check that it is all the way home now since I've got it stripped and we got a lot of people asking about taking it off I'll just whip it back off and then pop it on again as well the best thing to do is find one of the little um, semicircular cutouts where the actual sprocket locks in put a screwdriver in and just lift the snap ring slightly out and then go underneath with a second screwdriver to lift it above the little flange then again let's see, I'll try it from a different slot just work your way around there we go just twisting the screwdriver and there we go pings off all good not broken let's go back on again must apologise about the quality of the video this is filmed on a stills camera as I've left a video camera at home there we go we're back on, lost my little dust cover there we go so now the sprocket is held on the next thing after that is another little dust cover and that just slips on like that nice and easy then the other bit again where people get confused is lining up all the red and yellow dots on there on the little cable mechanism if you look on the hub just here you've got the little red dots all the red dots on the uh, plastic uh, cable mechanism need to line up with those so it'll just slip down on when they're all lined up it'll actually slot down far enough can't do it holding it up like that, there we go so now all the dots are lined up and it's slipped down then you take the locking piece line up the yellow dot with the other yellow dot and then just twist it to lock and then that's fitted you're all done, you just need to work out which non-turn washers you're using and mount it in the frame 